Henderson, major champ herself. You're going to see a lot of these side hill lies on this golf course, very undulating golf course. She was able to navigate that right to left lie with the little draw nearly perfectly. Two under on the day, get it to one under overall. Not a lot of movement in this putt. I think it's the most straightforward green on the, go on the golf course. You're used to the ups and downs and breaks, and that was just nice and easy. Yeah, we're seeing a lot of hybrids. In fact, before the, the tournament started, I talked to some of the club manufacturers, and they said a lot of the players were asking, uh, in B Park being one of them, for a new club distribution because the golf course is playing so long. What a great shot. She's usually pretty automatic. <laughs> Yeah, shorter today than it was yesterday. Terry by some uh, 16 yards and playing a lot easier. Lovely shot there from Jennifer Song. Flag not really moving either, Tom. Esther Hensley, seven over. This a moment ago. Saw a really good shot in here a moment ago. Wow. <laughs> the results even better this time. <laughs> yeah. Makes you want to go play 17 right now. And, and <laughs> that late turn. Stacy Lewis for birdie. That's a good chance. Straight back down the hill. Yeah, nicely played there. Kept it left of the hole. Didn't go too far by. Stop, didn't, found it. Just earlier, Samantha Morell, one of the club pros, eight of them. In the field this week. Good looking shot, it's at Millbrook Club in Greenwich, Connecticut. Beautiful birdie there, New England women's amateur champ. Jennifer Boros, another one of the club professionals in the field this week. A moment ago, her third at the par five. College golf at Sam Houston State. Excellent shot. Winner of the ANA inspiration, Miriam Lee on the tee at 14th. And that is going to work towards the hole. Really, really nice. Back down the green. And a great part, Stacy Lewis snaking one in. <laughs> For birdie at sixth, back down the green. So you can't be too aggressive, but not as fast as some of these greens are above the hole. Good birdie there from Mel. Struggled yesterday, 74. Olsen, this for birdie at 18, coming back down. Yeah, finds it. <laughs> those you just feel good about because they're a gift. Uh, you know you're going to have those 30, 40 footers every now and then. It's nice to get one to go. Go to 17. Nasa Hataoka, number five in the world. Rolex rankings. Go in that close. <laughs> On the tee at 17, in B Park at one under. 167 yards, and this is an aggressive play to a tuck flag. Wow, nice job, nice club selection. <laughs> Love when you're in B, and you've won seven majors. To the 10th, Jody, you were shot off at two over her second here at the par four. Difficult par four played the most difficult yesterday and today. It's playing long, a little into the wind. Oh, one of the rare birdie chances. Really good. You let me know second. Ooh. 
Got it uh, into the green side bunker in two. This is third. Again, the danger here is past the whole location. No danger here. About spot Ooh. on. First eagle of the week on any hole here at the KPMG Women's PGA Championship. That gets Sue O oh back to where she started the day at three over. 49 today. Known for her ball striking. Ooh, that would be beautiful. good ball striking. On the Pennsylvania State Women's Amateur Championship back in 2012. Excellent. The uh, 2020 North Florida PGA Champion. She was the Women's golf coach at Jacksonville for seven years, finishing up in 2019. So he's been around the game for a long time. Long club in, but really flat, accessible green, accessible location today. Got the kick. Taking advantage. Use that kick. You cannot do it any better what? than that. <laughs> Knew it was makeable all along. Come on. <laughs> How good is that? Perfectly done. Fist pump from her caddy. <laughs> Went to the fourth, and NB Park drove it in the left fairway bunker, played to here. So, bit of a struggle right now for NB Park. That wasn't a struggle. <laughs> Thought no. we were going to get another shot of the day. We've seen a lot of good shots here today. It's a birdie opportunity. And there's <laughs> another one right under the hole. Good tee shot and a great chance for a two for Norquist to get it to two under. The uh, border is on the left there, so I don't know if she was waving at somebody who was on the other side of the fence or the Phantom Gallery. And that's a two for Anna, so she gets to two under par. There's some room to get at this whole location. There's a little spine just left of it that will help push it towards the hole. Took that hot. Oh! Or you can come in from the right side, either way.